One bill before the Louisiana legislature would take lawmakers out of the process for increasing tuition and fees at colleges like LSU. Senate Bill 183 is only one of more than 700 proposed laws legislators will consider when the 2009 regular session begins this week. There are bills before both houses to create what's called the Forestry Product Fairness Act. That act would provide incentives and money for the purchase of raw forest products materials that would be used to create energy. To read the bill in its entirety, you can visit our website, twilatv.org. Forestry jobs are heading back to West Feliciana Parish. Tim Beck Paper Mill, just outside St. Francisville, is now scheduled to reopen next year, operated by new owners, Pan American Capital Group. Governor Bobby Jindal announced last week that as part of the deal, Pan American would employ a minimum of 200 workers by early 2010 and could create as many as 375 new jobs by 2012. Commissioner of Agriculture and Forestry Dr. Mike Strain says the jobs created at the paper mill have an average salary of $71,000 a year. Pan American Vice President Dean Schaefer says he's looking forward to getting the mill up and running. And a very important reason why Louisiana was because of its position within the wood basket. We feel like we can get really good access to wood at re very reasonable, stable prices that will allow us to uh, execute on our business plan. Tim Beck shuttered the plant back in July of 2007. Pan American reportedly bought the mill for $16 million and plans $30 million in upgrades to the facility. Part of the purchase agreement includes monetary incentives from the Louisiana Department of Economic Development. Those incentives include a performance-based grant of $4 million to put towards those improvements, a $2 million loan, and after the plan is in operation for three years, annual incentive payments of up to $3 million a year.